We're gonna show you inside. Pammy's, Pammy's Adventures. What she up to now? <laughs> Well, hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. Pammy here. It's great to see you watching me talking to you. Yes, indeed. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe. And if you are returning, hey, welcome back. Great to see ya. So as you can see by the title of this video, I'm going to show you around the hotel that I stayed in when I went to Florida. Yep, I've just come back from a fabulous trip there with my sister and we went to Disneyland. Doo -doo. Yep, I took these ones with me. <laughs> and we also went to Universal Studios, Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> and then we went on a fabulous cruise on the Norwegian Cruise Line. Now, I've been lucky to stay at a few of the Disney hotels, but this time, because it was uh, near Halloween, it seemed to be very popular and there was limited availability. So when I put in some prices, they were pretty pricey. They were up there. So we thought, let's try a hotel not on the Disney lot. And this hotel came up in our search. We weren't sure what to expect, so we did what you would all do. We looked on YouTube and we saw a video by The Lodge Guys. Hi guys. And your video helped us to see that it was a nice hotel. So we thought, let's give it a go. So I thought I'd make it a video too, so you can see what it's like to stay at this hotel. Enjoy. Well, hello, hello. This is Pammy here. And I'm just showing you the hotel that we stayed at when we stayed here in Florida. And it is the Red Lion Main Gate Hotel. Oh, Walk-ins welcome. It is off the freeway, Reedy Creek Boulevard. And then we come down here and we have Pizza Hut that's attached to the hotel. Very nice pizzas in there. We had a few and we're gonna go on in.
It's a great aircon, but boy, is it loud. I hope you enjoyed the video and the tour of this hotel. It is a very nice place to stay. We would stay there again. And we did feel very comfortable there. We arrived late at night, about 10 o'clock after 10, and felt fine, got an Uber. The staff were very friendly and helpful. They asked us if we wanted to be on the ground level or the first level, and we decided to go on the first level. Clean rooms, lots of towels, nice TV. This hotel provides a free shuttle bus at certain times that takes you to the nearest Disney park, which is Hollywood Studios, and then you can use the Disney shuttle buses to take you from park to park. They also offer a shuttle bus to take you to Universal Studios, but the time's a bit late, it's like 10 o'clock, so we took an Uber, which costs about 20 to $25, depending on the time that you go. It was a nice place to stay. It basically reminded me of a Disney hotel like the Pop Century ones. The only difference, no Disney characters all over the walls. So if you're thinking of going to this hotel, I would recommend it. And I forgot to say, there's a Walmart about 10 minutes walk away, which is huge. So we bought lots of food and put it in the fridge for a snack, snack, snack time. I will see you next time. And always remember to live your life with positivity, positivity, positivity. Day. See you later. Pammy's, Pammy's Adventures. What's she up to now? <laughs>